What's up everybody, Gaming Gargoyle here, and welcome back to Farmer's Life! I hope you had yourself a good series so far, if you're watching via the playlist. If you haven't, check out the playlist, links are down below. Um, and if not, you should be able to find it in the playlist. It should be a button underneath there somewhere. I think there is on YouTube, but anyway, as always, thank you for the likes, comments, subscribes, all the engagement to feed the algorithmic gods. You guys are all amazing and awesome. Oh, we only have... Ooh, Jeez, three hours and 42 minutes left. All right, well, we might have gotten up just a, a tad bit too early. Let's, uh, let's take another nap, shall we? And then we'll probably wake up hungry, so that'll work out. Yep, hungry and thirsty, so that works out to our advantage. How are we at? 36 minutes. All right. See? I knew we had it kind of sort of a little bit maybe figured out. Now, I do see that we have $3,700 in our bank account. woo -hoo! Um. So that means we are getting that much closer to our, our goal of getting all the equipment. But uh, that looks nice. I like that. That piece of equipment right there. That is a good piece of equipment. It brought up all these taters. Put them into those bags for us. Oh, if you haven't caught last episode, go watch it. Hint, hint, nudge, nudge, wink, wink. <laughs> Need to get the views up. <laughs> One second. I shouldn't have coughed so hard. Or laughed so hard. It made me cough. Let us check on our ladies. Hello, ladies. Oh, another eight eggs. Oh, that is so much better. That is four times better than what we were getting from me from before. We have a 400% increase. That's done. Might as well check on their fodder. Not their mother. Not their fodder. Their fodder. He's still not eating. I'll take just four of those, please. There we go. Chickens are all fed. Five minutes. Four minutes. Not bad. We can wait the the three two three three to three three minutes left. But, oh, yeah. this game is getting nice now that we're getting all the equipment. Uh, we're going to, uh, like I said, we're going to work on getting our first animal, the cow. Yeah, we'll see if we can make Fluffy jealous and have him come out of hiding. Not sure what's going on with Fluffy. Not sure if he's glitched, bugged, what, but uh, he's definitely in a in a downer mood. That's for sure. He's not hanging out with us. Normally, he's just right in front of the farm, running around all the time. At least from what I remember. Back in the day. Uh oh, whoops! Almost messed that up. Sometimes you just do something so often that you just make numerous mistakes in. Uh, fuel wood's good. Fuel mash good. Fuel wood mash. Fuel wood mash. I already looked at that one. Okay. Phew. Let us... Hmm. Let's go to the sawmill. Now, once again, today, I'm not going to the state farm today. We're going to hold off and save up all our beans. Make sure that we have lots of sugar, lots of glass jars, uh, everything that we need in order to uh, make even more monies. Okay, so now we go to Thaddeus' farm. And double check. Okay, we do have apples. Good. Everybody's loading in? Ah, everybody's loaded in. Hello, Helen. I'm just in it for the bottles and the sugar, sweetie. That's it. Thank you. No time for small talk. We're just hitting and getting. Now we'll go check up on our snares. I'm glad we don't have to have permissions to uh, put traps out on, on areas. That would suck. Oh, whoops. Went too far. That one's fine. That one's fine. Dang it. All right, off to town. 
Now we'll see how long it takes for this to load in. Do 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 do. Oh, not bad. Not as long as uh, we've had previously. Henry, I don't want to fight you, man. Uh, your sugar and your bottles, please. Thank you. Confirm that. And now it's a day, rest of the days for us at uh, 12 hours at noontime. So it's October. Yeah, if we would have planted August, I'm not sure if they would have uh, came up. Not to mention some of this fertility is zero. So, eh. I'm okay with what we did. We have lots and lots of uh, uh, potatoes in our inventory. That's all we need. Potatoes for mash. And speaking of mash, you know what we gotta do. The Bucket Brigade. I don't think we're gonna run out of taters anytime soon. 2,500? That'll definitely give us the ability to plant 500 next season for sure. 500 seems to be a good key number for me because it gives me 2,500 in the long run. Two hours, and you guessed it. They're cooking more mash. Alright, well. That's going to be my life. For the next little bit. I don't think you guys really want to sit here and watch me just cook mash. And fill up buckets of water and the distillery. So, maybe we make this a bit of a shorter episode. And I'll come back with you guys when it's... Uh, Time to do the rinse repeat and uh, make some purchases. <laughs> I'll see you folks in a couple of minutes. Well, now that was a long day. I made, I think, four, possibly five batches of mash. Uh, let's look in the cupboard here. Yeah, we have 46 right now, plus another four in our inventory. Yeah, I say we're doing pretty good. Uh, this will be ready in three minutes. That gives us enough time to grab the eggs. Let's see, it's 10 a.m. Boy, we're starting to push later and later into the day with these stills. Yeah, it's going to happen, though. Perfect. So they're going to be ready by 10 tonight. We have eggs and jars in our inventory that we don't need. And we can grab something to eat at the same time. Perfect. There we go. We are well drank and fed. Drunk and fed. We're going to go to the sawmill. We shall confirm up the sale of 32 bottles of alcohol and the purchase of 20 empties. That gives us $9,400. Oh, that, 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 that's starting to feel a little bit more security in our retirement. You know what I'm saying? We got some monies in the pocket. But we still have to buy sugar and glass bottles and all that other stuff here too. So we're not that far ahead. But we're making our way through. I did grab a sugar, right? Yes, okay. So we'll check on our snare traps. It's a bit of a routine at the moment with the way everything's going. I see one standing. I'd like to see one down, but that's all right. Nothing. All right. So now we go off to the town. And we'll see how long it takes for... The lo oh, the load-in was like instantaneous. Nice. Okay. That's getting better. That was getting pretty rough. To be honest, that was getting really rough. We are in November. Let us trade for your sugar. And your empty bottles, please. Thank you. Well, that gives us $8,000. Well. Well. $8,000 ain't nothing to sneeze at. You know what I'm saying? Hmm. We might just be able to go and buy ourselves another piece of equipment there today, I think. 
I think that's what's on the agenda. Let's uh, drop off that. Let's drop off that. Let's jump in our handy dandy tractor. We'll disconnect the digger. There we go. Get in the tractor. Go to our map. We're going to the state agricultural farm. Isn't there supposed to be some fencing? There we go. That's better. A little bit laggy, but we can handle the laggy. Ruh-roh laggy. Let's get ourselves situated. We'll talk to the gentleman, Stan. Let's see. We could do the mower, the plow. We have the cedar. We have the threshing machine. We have the digger. We have the engine. And we have the cutter. Okay. So, is more than I got to get both. So, for now, let's just get the mower. And we'll save up our pennies for the plow. $5,600 for the plow. Connect. Oh, 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 oh. I don't want to go in reverse. I want to go forward. Just going around in circles. Why not? Now we go home. Oh, no. I know what I want to do. Pal. I want to buy some more fuel. Uh, Let's say... 40? Alright, that, that, that wasn't too, too bad for hurting in the cash department. We should have enough money for tomorrow in order for us to go ahead and get ourselves situated with the second machine, or with the last machine. Back it up, drive it forward, keep it in first gear. Let's just see how this works. Alright, so it says we have to put the blade down. Okay, so T. Okay, the blade's down. Now, what do we do? We just drive? That's what I'm guessing we do. We just drive, then what happens? Oh. Oh, I see. It leaves behind some little chunks. Okay. Always got to play with your toys when you first get them. Wow! Alright, so what's ever on the right hand side of the wheel is what's going to get cut. Whoa, we are hitting some wicked frames. Wow, that's uh... Alright, so just so you know, if you don't have a very powerful machine, you're going to hit some frames. Uh, you know what? Yeah, we can just leave it here for now. Uh, detach. We'll add fuel. That should be full. Come over to this one. Might as well add fuel. Oh, tank's already full. For now, we're moving our gasoline out into the barn. Yeah, I know, I know. You shouldn't leave gas out in the barn, but yeah, come on. What's a guy supposed to do, huh? Guess it's better than having it in your house by your feet or your bed, inhaling the fumes at night. No wonder why he was complaining about, you know, wanting alcohol. The guy was being poisoned by gasoline fumes all night long. He was dreaming it. He's like, oh, I need alcohol. Okay, that is done. Done like yesterday's dinner. And yeah, you guessed it. It's time to cook some mash. Let's do the monster mash. And you know what? Yeah, I'll just do another cut and I'll meet you guys in the morning. I'm not going anywhere. I'm not buying anything right now. I'm just making mash and keeping the stills going. Making mash, keeping the stills going. 
nothing exciting. So I'll be back with you folks once I get to the point of uh, waking up in the morning and doing it all over again. Good morning, everyone. Rise and shine. It is bright and early, 6 a.m., but we got things to do today. It's Christmas Day again, so we have to go visit Matthew. Uh, no eggs yet, though? A little too early for the egg production? Okay. Well, I was hoping. Um, we have some potato mash that is ready. So we'll get ourselves prepared for our, our mash... Uh, distillery thing, which will be in like, I don't know, four hours, something like that. Let, let me just take a look. Yeah, about four hours from now. So let's uh, fast travel to the church. Ah, uh, gentlemen preachers should be there about now. Or within a couple of moments of us arriving, I would hope. Oh, hold on. There is a fence there. And luckily enough, I just knew where the entrance was. Otherwise, I would have been running against nothing. All right, let's take a look and see 701. Mr. Preacher? I thought you showed up at 7 o'clock. What, you're running banker's hours, man? How am I supposed to decorate this tree? No. Leaving and coming back didn't work. All right. Well, that's the case. We'll get some stuff set up down here. Should have went to the marketplace first. Dang it. Oh, well. Take the ladder. I'll set the ladder up. I want to come in here and say, Hello, Sophie. I would like all your sugar. And I would also like all your bottles. Thank you, Sophie. Have yourself a wonderful day. Hopefully at 8 p.m. This guy will be ready for me. Or 8 a.m. Not 8 p.m. That would suck. Yes, and my guy's hungry. I know. He's hungry like the wolf. Oh, come on now. Oh, 723. Ah, oh. There's no way to nap in the church? Come on, the pews are right here. People nap in church all the time. Why can't we just sit on this pew and nap for an hour? Ah, oh, man. Ah, oh, at least it's warmer in here. Let's, let's, let's warm ourselves up by the candlelight. Oh, brr, cold. So cold. Freezing cold. Oh, it's still got another half an hour to go. And if I remember right, that other chest over there had nothing else in it, so I'm guessing this chest over here won't have anything else in it. Ooh, you yourself a little dizzy going around there. Yep, oh, empty. Sad days. Whee! Nothing. Ugh. Feel like Cornelius off of Rudolph the Red Nosed Reindeer. Cornelius! Come on. I can run around this whole church all day long. Waiting for you, Mr. Priest. Are you going to pop your head out and say hi? Come on, man. Pop out and say hi. Not, not even 15 minutes work early. Don't you live here at the church? I, I don't know. I, I don't know. Maybe he lives in that dilapidated house over there. I don't know. 752. I wonder if I can do a lap around the church before this guy shows up. Just, you know, gotta get the cardio up. Gotta keep the, uh, the blood pumping, blood flowing, keeping warm. Don't want to run too much, though. We don't want to build up a sweat. And we're back before he's even here. There he is. Hey, buddy. Yes, can I help? Oh, another illuminated Christmas. The tree inside, the tree at the downtown. Okay. Look for a box. Got it. It happens to be over here this time. This box is always somewhere random in the area. You just got to find it. All right, so that's done. Whee! Thump. Now we have to do the tree downtown. Stop here. Go to there. There. I didn't want to get bullied by Henry. Hmm. 
No fighting, Henry. Please. Ah. Uh, can't you tell I'm starving, dude? I don't want to fight. I just want to get home and eat. What about you, priest? Have you got anything? You have beer mead? Nope. Just that bloody ring. You expensive. Uh, moonshine. Hey, we'll take the extra moonshine. <gasps> Vodka. Yes, we'll take that. That's a great gift for the guy when we go to buy the cow. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Is there any reward? Task completed. You're welcome. How's your status? Oh, you're super happy anyway, aren't you? Cool. All right, well, goodbye. We'll go home. We'll get ourselves something to eat. Because as you can tell from the red fade, we're dying of hunger. You just can't take it anymore. Oh, and I forgot to pick up all those bushes that we cut down, too. Hey, that's that's good fodder. Don't want to do that. All right, we'll put you in here. Put you in here for now. Grenades. Grenades. Need the Rudolph hat in here. Oh, I should have dropped off the sugar in the bottles. Dang it. Okay, you go there. You go there. Oh, no, I need 16 bottles. Oh, jeez. Uh, cancel? Okay. Uh, sometimes I get a little squirrely. How much longer for these? One hour's worth. Okay. Uh, how are we doing for firewood inside the stove? 79. Okay. How are we doing out here? 61. All right. All right. We're not doing too, too bad. Um, I want to collect these bottles up and then I'm going to hold off on doing another run till about 5 p.m. today and at 5 p.m. we'll do another run right now we have twenty three hundred dollars I want to make that about five K and uh, we're going to get ourselves another toy or maybe not it's winter time it's cold but yeah look at this look at this mower that thing is badass. You do not want to be walking in front of that. It will just chop your legs off. Not cool. Jeez. Casimir, you run a risky business, man. How do you get WCB? What, you don't have WCB? No. Oh. Well, that makes perfect sense. Alright, well, we'll pick up some of this hay. We'll throw it into the cutting machine. Because I don't need it for anything other than fodder. Don't want to overburden myself. Okay, so that's that's kind of neat that that's how the mower does it. Just picks it up and just puts it into these giant paddy thingies. So we have more fodder to use there. Nice. I wish that would lock down better. So that when you walked into it, it doesn't, uh, doesn't hurt you. Oh, they're fine. Get some eggs. Get some more eggs. More eggs. More better. Drop those off. Come over here and hope that we're ready. Oh, four minutes. Not bad. Running around doing all the chores, doing everything on time, getting the church stuff done. I'm impressed with myself. I'd say I've done pretty well today. Pat myself on the back. Nobody else will. There you go. If you made it this far into the video, type pat yourself on the back, G, in the, uh, in the comments. Everybody will think I did a good job and they won't realize that I... Uh, 
I, uh, I asked for it to get done. <laughs> Let's mess with some people's heads, shall we? Uh, what am I going to feeling this? Oh, this was running. Okay. I just had a gut feeling it wasn't. But my gut feeling was wrong. So that's a good thing. In this case. Sound is all weird here because I have so many of these machines close together. Okay. Uh, I want to check something. I want to check fuel. Okay, we're good. Uh, get off. Go to the sawmill. From the sawmill, we'll sell all our bottles and buy some bottles. Go to Anne's place, check our snares. So first of all, give him 34 or whatever it was. 6k. Oh, thank you, boys. Thank you. Go to Farm Thaddeus. Need to buy ourselves some sugar and some bottles. Sugar. Bottles. Then we need to check our snares. Because, of course, we do have apples on us. Pew! There's a reason why I always carry apples on me. Because of these snares. They haven't paid off the greatest, but at the same time, they paid off, yeah, better than if I didn't have one moat. Look at this. We got ourselves a stag. Perfect. Okay. Throw in a bait. Dash travel home. Now we'll skin the deer, get rid of all the meat and everything else. And what should we do after that? Should we go buy that final piece of equipment and then save up for animals for another episode maybe? Yeah, I think that might work. What do you guys think? I think that it, uh, my decision would have already been made by the time you guys put it in the comments. But hey. I asked. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, I want to keep the vodka. Do I have any more vodka at all? No, I don't. Alright. reason why I was hoping for more vodka was to... Oh, I scared the meat. To bribe that guy for the animals. Uh, is there anything here that needs for me to be thinking about done? No, it doesn't look like. All right. Okay, well, if I tick this, it says connect. All right, I don't want it to connect. Need to go to the Yeah, we'll go to the agriculture farm and drive in. It'll be smarter that way. So we got the mower. Now that's a serious piece of uh ankle cutter offers, that's for sure. Don't think I'd want to be uh standing in front of that machine when it's driving by. Alright. Stan. Let us trade for the final piece of equipment. Oh, no way. Oh, man. I thought we had enough. But in order for us to have enough, we have to go sell this fur. Thank God that we got this pelt. Oh. I didn't think buying all the sugar and everything else was going to bring us down that low. Oh, well. We are lucky. We are lucky. Saved by the fur. 5,800. We need 56. Phew. Saved by the buck. <laughs> I'm happy with that. Oh. Lucky, 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 lucky. Let's trade for the plow, sir. Thank you so much for your business, buddy. I'll come back and get you in a minute. Right now, I got two bottles of vodka that's got this guy's name written all over it. 
The other guy downtown, town, he starts off with a really bad attitude towards you. This guy was only at half. The other guy starts off at like 30. So, yeah, here we go. Shall we talk? Look at that. Perfect. We can now buy animals all at the cheapest price. Thirty-three hundred for a cow. Look at that. Oh, what's this? A bull? No, it always looks like it's about to charge, but it's a lazy beast. Unless it's about, unless it's about the ladies, friends, and the cattle herd, then it's all fired up for the job. Okay. And then the cow. Yeah, well, it's cow. I wonder if I keep producing milking for me, and I surely hope it's not pregnant. Interesting. So yeah, thirty-three hundred for the cow. Forty-eight dollars for the brush. We're going to also need the bigger feeding rack. And that'll be for the cows. Or cows, uh, if it, uh, if we have to get another one for some reason. So, yeah. So, 812 there. So, we need about 4,000. We ain't doing it this time around. Nope. Nope. We ain't got that type of money. We're down to, uh, where is it? 258 bucks. So, nope. Not happening today. But we did get... All the equipment for the tractor. We are fully stacked, loaded, ready to rock on that. I am very happy. Uh, it's getting dark out. And connect. Perfect. All right. Back home we go. Uh -huh. I figured we should have to keep backing up on it. You just never know which way you're going to point with this machine. I think it does have a pattern. I just, I haven't figured it out yet. You know what? Let's take this... Mm -hmm. Did we buy... Plow. Okay, we did buy the plow. I was like, wait a minute. Did we just buy another mower? Let's just get ourselves hooked up, disconnected. Well, we did it. That's all the equipment. Whoa, that's some bright light. Next piece of equipment that we're probably most likely going to be needing is this one. So. We'll get ourselves set up for it. A little back a little bit more. Oh, too much. Eh, call that good enough. Sweet. What the heck? Is that a patty? Is that a cow patty? Fluffy, are you leaving cow patties around here, man? Well, let's see. Uh, yeah, we got like another four hours for that, so... Yeah, time to make some more mash and probably, yeah, just make more mash for the rest of the evening. That's all I'm going to do. So that's where we're going to end things off here today. As always, thank you so very much for watching. Greatly appreciate you. I would like to say a uh, special thanks to all the members of the channel, the guys that are floating through the list. Thank you so very much. Without you, I couldn't. Uh, without your support, I wouldn't be able to, be, to, to be, be, make videos and uh, do live streams and hang with y'all. So thank you very much, every last one of you. I hope the best and good luck for you all. Um, if you haven't already, like, comment, subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, no matter where you are in the world today. I hope you have yourself a wonderful morning, evening, afternoon, good night. And uh, I'll see you in the next episode. Bye!